Hello guys and welcome to the video. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how you can add Google Maps to WordPress. Okay, so we're going to be using this article available at Weekly Marks as a guide. So you can check the description for a link to this article. So there are basically two methods um, of adding Google Maps to uh, WordPress. The first one involves using Google Embeds.net, which is a website that helps you generate Google Maps. So I'm just going to open this in a new tab and show you how it works. So the URL is embedgooglemap.net. So uh, it's very easy to use. You just have to enter an address here. So enter the address of your company or your business. And over here, you can adjust the zoom level. So if you want this zoomed in, um, you can add that here and you can also reduce it here also. You can also increase the width and height of the map itself. So if you want this a little bit smaller, you can configure everything here. So once you're done with the configuration, just click on get HTML code and it's going to give you this HTML code that you can embed on your WordPress post or page. So I'm going to copy this and go over to WP Marks demo and I'm going to add this to a post. So I'll click on add new and let's add this to the post okay so just click on the plus sign and type in custom html okay so you have to use the custom html block if you're using the classic editor you have to switch over to html mode okay so i'm just going to click on this and paste in the code so this is the map code so once you click on preview it should give you the map uh preview on your post okay so that's just one way of adding google maps this is by far the easiest way uh you can also add google maps using a plugin so i'm gonna scroll there okay so you can actually use a plugin for this uh the name of the plugin is vp google maps so i'm just gonna copy this and let's go back to our site and go back to the dashboard i'm not going to save this and go over to plugins click on add new so we're going to add in that plugin and i'll show you how it works so i'm going to paste in vp google maps here and as you can see we already have this installed on our wordpress website so to use this map, uh, once you install and activate it, just go over to your installed plugins here and click on settings. Okay. And I click on settings here, or you can just scroll down and you get this map here. So just click on maps and it's going to take you to the dashboard. So to create multiple maps, you need to be on the pro plan so this is the free plan and the free plan only allows you to have just one map so i'm just going to click on edit so i'll show you how to set up uh, the single map so over here you have to name the map itself and you can also set a width and height just like how you do it for embed google map.net and over here, you add in an address. So this is where you add in an address. I'm just going to copy this address here and paste it here. Okay, so you can actually add multiple addresses, which are also called markers. So I already have one added here. I'm just going to delete this. So I'll show you how the adding process looks like. So I'm going to click on add. You can add animation if you want, if you want the marker to bounce. So just click on add marker and your address the address that you're trying to add is going to be displayed on the map here you can also increase the zoom level and increase the zoom level from here so almost the same thing as um, that of embed google map so once you're done with everything um, you can save the map so just click on save map and all your changes are going to be saved and 
in order to use this map you just have to copy the short code so if you click on this it's going to copy the short code so let's go back to post and click on add new and embed this on a post okay so once the post is loaded we're going to add in the short code uh block because this is a short code so once you have this added it should um display this map on a live site so we're just going to preview this to make sure so let's see how it looks on the live site so as you can see successfully added the map uh i suggest using this embed google map.net if you're on a budget but if you can afford to use um, the pro plan of the of this vp google map plugin it's uh, more suitable because you can actually just arrange your all your maps and reuse them whenever you want instead of generating this messy code every single time you need to add a google map to your wordpress site so i hope you guys found this video useful um, if you have any questions related to adding google maps to wordpress just leave a comment um, in the comment section below and you can subscribe to the channel for more content with everything covered in this video i'll see you guys in the next one